Our oceans are full of strange and mesmerising life forms, and so far we know very little about them. Biologists around the world are eager to explore the deepest parts of the world's oceans and acquire as much information about life underneath the water as they can. Some of the alien colonies and mysterious giant creatures they have encountered look like mythical beings. Today we'll tell you all about some of the most incredible things filmed underwater that no one was supposed to see. But before we begin, take a moment to give this video a thumbs up and support our channel by clicking the subscribe button. Fish Transparent Head The concept of a glass-like fish whose brains we can see with our naked eyes is no longer just a part of the sci-fi world. Recently, marine biologists have caught a glimpse of a unique barrelai fish about 600 meters deep in Monterey Bay, California. It had a transparent head with glowing green eyes that were visible through its forehead. These fish swim in complete darkness and their eyes can be clearly seen through the fluid-filled shield which covers their head. Its eyes are extremely light-sensitive and can be oriented straight up towards the top of its head. Ticklish Stingray Recently, a video of this ticklish stingray went viral in which we can observe a person tickling the fish who laughs wholeheartedly. The little stingray looks adorable. The baby stingray is laying on its back with gloved hands A man proceeds to tickle the sea creature. It curls up its wings and opens its mouth, forming a shape resembling what humans do when they smile. Two visible dots are its nostrils, which move in response to being tickled. Giant Jellyfish A jellyfish about the size of a human being was seen off the coast of southwest England and was caught on camera by marine biologists who were busy studying the region. Meanwhile, they came across this giant. Lizzie Daly, a marine biologist, stated that the jellyfish was as big as her body as it was estimated to be longer than 5 feet. Generally, they grow up to 3.2 feet and weigh around 55 pounds, but this one was extraordinarily enormous. Alien Egg Marine biologists stumbled upon this seemingly alien embryo sac in the deep sea. It belongs to a giant squid. Three divers off the western coast of Norway came across this gelatinous blob equal to the size of an adult human being. We can see the divers circling around the spherical blob surrounded by a transparent membrane with a dark mass suspended inside. Inside it, we can see numerous small spheres of eggs having baby squids. There were hundreds and thousands of these baby squids in the sack. According to scientists, the natural elasticity of the egg sac helps maintain a sufficient space between each squid embryo to ensure that enough supply of oxygen required for the development of baby squids reaches every single embryo. 26-foot-long sea worm Some divers off the coast of New Zealand encountered a gigantic sea worm that was approximately 300 feet long. It is a sea animal known as pyrosome. They're also called cockroaches of the sea. They're able to pull food even from the most inhospitable environments. These worm-like creatures are translucent, can glow and look like a plastic bag floating in the water. Their bodies resemble gelatinous organisms like jellyfish. Octopus Attack In this video, a giant octopus can be seen attacking a marine biologist in Primorsky Krai in Russia's Far East. The octopus attempts to wrap around the arms and equipment of the biologist who tries to pull himself out of its grip and finally manages to get rid of it. However, the octopus clings to his camera rig as he throws it away. As the octopus possesses several tentacles, therefore, it is extremely difficult to detach oneself from it. The diver, being a photographer, also made the most of this opportunity and filmed the spectacle. Chained Up Animals In 2016, in the vicinity of the far-flung island of Kokoya, Indonesia, marine biologists made a shocking discovery that created ripples of anger among the netizens. Two dugongs, which are rare sea animals, were found chained up inside underwater cages. Investigations revealed that a local fisherman had trapped these dugongs and kept them as a tourist attraction. He used to ask for money for seeing the dugongs or taking pictures with them. The pair seemed to be a mother and her calf. No one had known that the rare creatures had been trapped there. However, from the visible deep cuts from the rope that was fastened around the tail of the mother dugong, it was deduced that the pair had undergone this torture for a few months. Insatiable Hairy Frogfish this weird fish looks like a coral, but in reality it is the hairy or striped frogfish. They're covered with thousands of fleshy hair-like skin extensions which help them blend in with soft corals, sponges, and seaweed. It's said that these hairs mimic the spines of urchins. 
They resort to stalking and possess the ability to change colors to match their surrounding habitat, which further helps them in disguising themselves. Their stomach is extremely elastic, and they're known to swallow fish twice their own size. An exploding sea worm During a deep-sea dive, a marine biologist came across this wriggly worm while he was busy exploring the underwater reefs in Mexico. This strange snake-like creature swam for about a minute and then exploded and disappeared into the water. In this video, you can see it exploding and its pieces scattering all across the water. The research showed that it is a specific type of worm called polychaete worm, which explodes to disperse its gametes into the water for reproduction. They generally either swim to the top of the water's surface or move into a high current area and explode. Underwater Fantasyland There is a unique museum located off the coast of Ayanapa in Cyprus. Tourists can visit it after putting on a diving suit. The water in the museum is crystal clear and maintained so that biodiversity can flourish. All the sculptures erected in the museum are made with neutral pH materials. For attracting marine life, all these sculptures will be covered in marine biomass. More than 130 sculptures are installed in the museum. They depict a variety of statues from figurative statues to trees. The artwork of trees has particularly been designed to attract marine life on a larger scale. These sculptures have been installed at varying depths starting from the seabed to the surface. Hence, it resembles a path through an underwater forest. Struggling Sea Turtle A marine biologist spotted a sea turtle struggling with a discarded fishing net. He jumped in to rescue the poor creature. The sea turtle was wrapped up in a fishing net and had struggled for quite a long time. It seems exhausted in the footage too. He brought the turtle to the boat and the crew cut the net and freed the poor entangled fellow. It was estimated that the turtle might have been struggling with the net for four to five days and the net had cut his neck. Giant Spider Crab Congregation this spectacular scene depicting hundreds of large orange crabs on the bare sandy seafloor seems quite mysterious. In Port Phillip Bay near Melbourne, Australia, every year thousands of massive crabs gather in order to shed their old skin and permit the growth of new skin and form a new shell. They conduct this process together to ward off any predators eating away at them. The process of molting takes up to an hour. They perform this process simultaneously. A soft-molted crab becomes irresistible to predators such as rays, seals, and birds. The congregation of crabs enhances their chances of survival as protection lies in their numbers similar to the mammal herds. Rare Jellyfish This may look like a UFO pod, but it is a rare jellyfish resembling a firework explosion. This dazzling jellyfish lights up the darkest corners of the ocean and presents a mesmerizing display. Marine scientists who got a chance to witness this spectacular sight explained that the scientific name of the firework jellyfish is Halotrephes massi. It's usually found at a depth of 4,000 feet in the waters of Baja, California in the Gulf of Mexico. The jellyfish doesn't illuminate on its own. It's usually invisible as it swims through the water. However, when lights from the ROV Hercules hit the jellyfish, it reflected off the radial canals that move nutrients through its gelatinous body. Giant Eyeball in October 2012, a softball-sized eyeball was found on the beach in Pompano, Florida. Immediately, the internet started buzzing with questions of whose eyeball it was. Initially, people speculated that it came from a squid. However, after detailed examination, biologists concluded that it was cut out of a swordfish hauled in by a deep-sea angler. The conclusion was based on the straight cuts on the bone around the eyeball, which led experts to deduce that an angler had cut it out of a swordfish and threw it overboard. Marine biologists related it to swordfish based on its size, color, and structure. Whale Fall A lot of animals residing in the depths live off the material that falls from the surface, such as dead plankton, dead animal shells, and other inorganic material. Sometimes there is a feast deep inside the ocean when whale fall takes place. On this occasion, the carcass of a whale falls onto the ocean floor at a depth of approximately 3,300 feet. It provides plenty of nutrients to the creatures residing in the deep sea. The decomposition of a whale carcass takes place in different stages and supports a variety of marine biological communities. Scavengers such as rayfish, hagfish, and sharks consume the soft tissues for months, whereas microbes live off the energy released from chemical reactions. It forms the basis of the ecosystems for as long as the food lasts. Underwater Stonehenge we're still baffled by the mystery of the monolithic legend behind Stonehenge found on land. There's also a Stonehenge underneath the waters of Lake Michigan. 
Marine biologists found a massive boulder with a prehistoric carving of a mastodon and a series of stones arranged like Stonehenge. These were found deep inside the lake, but their exact location remains a secret as this condition was placed by the local Indian tribes who wanted to avoid the influx of tourists. Stonehenge has carvings of a prehistoric species of creatures resembling elephants. These are called mastodons. They have a hump, head, trunk, tusk, and triangular-shaped ears. Even the shape of its legs suggests that the people who carved this lived alongside this prehistoric animal. Injured Giant Squid This man, along with his wife seen in the video, was paddleboarding. They came across a massive squid that was swimming in shallow waters about 20 miles north of Cape Town. He saw the squid struggling and tried to help it. He pulled it on his paddleboard and brought it to the beach. The squid was injured and its several tentacles were missing. It was covered with white marks that were actually worms exiting the squid's body called spermatophores. This confirmed that the squid was male. Moving Tentacles The locals were puzzled to see this mysterious sea creature having strange squirming tentacles. The dark brown alien-like creature washed up on a southern Vietnamese beach on the shore of Xinjiang province. Locals showed their inability to relate to it in an animal, vegetation or something else. Some people stated that it was a monster and should be sent back into the ocean. Some experts say it's a piece of seaweed that reacted to the air. It has dozens of smaller tentacles on each branch. Two-Headed Turtle In October 2021, marine biologists at the Cape Wildlife Center in Cape Cod, Massachusetts found a two-headed turtle. It was a diamondback terrapin that hatched at a protected nesting site. The turtle also possessed six legs. Experts believe that the two heads resulted from a condition called bicephaly, which is a rare anomaly that could take place due to genetic and environmental factors that affect the embryo at the development stage. X-ray results indicated the presence of two spines fused further down its body. They were nicknamed Turtle Mary Kate and Ashley Olson. Experts were shocked to see how one head controlled three legs and they were able to swim together. Mysterious Offerings to Gods a series of mysterious objects that relate to strange offerings made to stone gods were discovered by marine biologists in Lake Titicaca. They found stone boxes of varying sizes and shapes used for preserving the contents of figurines of humans, male and female, as well as llamas, and bracelets made of rare and valuable materials like silver, gold and rare shells. These valuable offerings were probably made to supernatural deities by the elite people from the Tiwanaku culture and artifacts were related to the Incan religion as similar stone boxes were discovered at human sacrifice sites in the Andes. These remained undisturbed for the last 500 years. These shed light on the Inca religion and its rituals. Underwater Alien Colony Recently, this video showing a weird and mysterious colony of living organisms on the bottom of a river went viral on social media. It looked like a small city of space aliens preparing to wage war on the Earth. Some people commented that it seemed as if a plague was ready to hit the Earth. Well, the biologists clarify that it is normal and this happens when algae undergoes photosynthesis and as a result it releases oxygen which is trapped in the airtight net. Before moving to number one on this list, take a look at this creature in this picture. It may look like an alien but it's actually been sighted in the depths of Earth's oceans. The bizarre, unidentified entity was captured by an underwater camera. Many people tell ancient tales of such mythological-looking creatures dwelling in the depths of the oceans and seas. Do you have any idea what it is? Decomposing Monster This clip was shot back in 2016 and was taken by some people who visit Carabao Island in the vicinity of the Gulf of the Philippines. They observed a strange creature lying lifeless on the sandy beach. It had several horns protruding out of its body and also has a fish tail. The creature probably washed up on the beach during a storm. It possessed black eyes and ears similar to those of a bull. The people who filmed it claimed that the creature was about two meters long and its upper body resembled normal animals. Its fish-like tail suggested otherwise. As the body had decomposed, making a learned opinion was difficult. We hope you enjoyed learning about these strange underwater finds. Share your views in the comment section below. We'll be back soon with another amazing video. Until then... Have a great time.